Hey and welcome back to another tutorial. In this video we're going to show how to create a little bit more realistic light. So if you can see this is a one light so here is just a flat light. It's very flat since it's only emissive and it comes very flat. But if you if you take a look on this one you can see there is some death. I hope you can see it like some death and some reflection on top. And this is a trick if you put a reflection layer on top of your emissive so you get a little bit more depth to the light bulb so this is the tutorial and let's just get right into it first thing we want to do we want to apply some materials so here is some materials that i already made but we're going to use new ones so i'm going to select this uh, metal and what i want to do here is to uh just apply one of the metals that there are in the in here already so I'm gonna just I uh, I'm not gonna use the black rust that we did um iron iron uh, iron blurry let's do this one so I'm just gonna select it again and I'm gonna right click here and I'm gonna um select all objects and scene I'm gonna take this one and I'm just gonna apply to selection and on 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 the size it says here five c centimeters centimeters so what I'm gonna do here um, since it doesn't have a map so that's uh, a little bit of a problem let's just go like this and click like that now we have a map so we can uh, now just right here 5 cm and now uh, it's better so now we have uh, some material so for the light material that's the main thing so we are gonna start with just uh, applying some just gonna apply uh, some emissive material and here we have the new choice that we can choose temperature so one, once you choose temperature <coughs> you can instead of color you can use temperature and now you can use the regular light bulb uh, measurement so I usually put between 3 for a warm light so 3500 to 4500 I like the 4000 uh, let's do 4500 I like the, the light of that. So now we have this light. And we're going to put the intensity 1.5. Um, and let's render this now and see what we get. Okay, so uh, as you can see, it's it's not working. Because the, uh, if we go here, we can see the face is... is uh, reverse so we are just gonna go like that and we're gonna do reverse faces and now we can try uh, we can apply the material as well and uh, I think it's already apply let's see now how this comes through okay so let's just center the the viewport uh, the viewport a little bit and zoom in something like this and <clears throat> now we're not gonna touch the black metal uh, maybe we can adjust that may maybe do something better and yeah it's not like perfect but this is not the tutorial about so we're gonna adjust the light now a lot of time when you have a light like this it just comes flat like you see it's just a circle and to give it a little bit more depth so there is like a trick so the trick we're gonna save this one and we're gonna save it to the history so we're gonna open the history and we're just gonna save it here so now we'll, we'll have it there so we can compare it we're gonna put this will be the A and and now uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna apply another coat we're gonna go here and we're gonna add a reflection and now this is the important part since the reflection is underneath the light so you can't see the reflection we're gonna drag it on top 
and we can make the reflection a little bit stronger with taking the IOR a little bit higher. So instead of 1.55, we're gonna do 2.55. So that's a little bit stronger. So now if we render, we're gonna get a little bit more depth and the light won't be so flat. So uh, this is one of the points that I think make lights a little bit better. So let's try now to compare uh, uh, the A. This no, this one is A. So you can see here some really subtle uh, curve on the edge. So if we want a little bit more, if we want the effect a little bit stronger, so we can or or increase this for like maybe let's say let's do like uh, 3.5 uh, the the reflection and or we can also put the light source a little bit lower so then we can do have a little bit stronger um, reflection and the light won't be uh, so subtle so this this is already much better so as you can see there is like a small bump here and uh, let's try to compare it um, so if you see this one is with the reflection so you get all those nice reflections it's very subtle but this one without a reflection is just total flat but if you just adjust a little bit of reflection you get some here you have a little bit here you have some a little bit there and it shows the shape more than just the flat color so that's the video thank you for watching please like and subscribe and have a good one